Camp Series this morning here at 907 and we're headed to the Phoenix Conservatory of Music where they're going to be helping students feel the beat. Oh yeah, offering a number of classes centered around music appealing to a wide range of ages. So Kylie is live there this morning with a look at what they have to offer. Good morning guys, I have the drumsticks and that is a dangerous combination. I don't have any coordination and I've realized I have a newfound respect for like Travis Barker and all those famous drummers because this is wild being able to coordinate all of this. Uh, this is just one of the activities that you could learn. Maybe your child wants to perfect their drumming or learn more about music and different instruments. We are here at the Phoenix Conservatory of Music. We can start that piano. Let's get things going here as we talk a little bit about some of the summer camps that they are offering. I love this group. I've done a number of stories about them over the year and Regina she runs things here at the Phoenix Conservatory of Music she joins us now you guys ready for summer absolutely summer is one of the most exciting times of year we have six or seven different age groups in the building at the same time in various places uh, so we're able to offer a lot of really great musical learning opportunities and this year we are offering them for free did you hear that free will take free right as they say so walk me through how this was able to happen that you're able to offer all your camps free we have been blessed with a grant through the Arizona Department of Education uh, ESSER 3 funding that kind of helps fill some of the gaps uh, for the break in in-person learning so while well, the students are here and they're going to be learning things like beat making audio production video game music scoring uh, composition um, playing in a band together and, and not like a school band but like a rock band right uh, um, when they're learning those things, they're also learning some literacy skills, they're learning some math skills, and they're learning a ton of social and emotional learning. And because of that, we're able to offer the grant for free, uh, or the summer camps for free for the next two years. Oh my goodness, that's huge. Okay, so we know that space is filling up, so walk me through what's still available, because you still have some options, but it's mostly for the teenagers. That's right. So we are offering summer camps through uh, pre-K all the way up through age 17. Our pre-K through uh, 10 is pretty much filled up. We have a couple of spaces here and there for like beginning orchestra, beginning band, uh, those types of things for the 9 to 13 year olds. But our summer camps for teens are really open still. Uh, we haven't even started marketing them and those are things literally like audio production, beat making, video game music and scoring, uh, playing in a rock band, uh, guitar fret masters, learning how to play bass, singing musical theater, singing in front of a microphone. So like really specific intensives. And so those camps are like, they come in the morning, they play music all day with a peer group that wants to play music just as much as they do. And they eat some lunch in the middle and then they play some more music. So it's, it's all music all the time for a full week. I want to come. That sounds fun. I'm like, oh, I'm going to live out my dream to be a singer. But speaking of being a singer, I already have a singer here. Before we go, we want to talk to AJ. AJ, good morning. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thank you for having me. So you have been coming here for 10 years. Why do you love this place? Um, I love this place because it is just amazing. You get to interact with a bunch of people. You get to do what you love. I've been singing since I was five years old, like, and coming here, it's just made me a stronger person. It gave me a lot of social, um, Helped you socially yeah. too, right? And I'm assuming your voice, how have they helped you to be able to hone your voice over those 10 years? Um, like make my voice stronger? Yeah. Um, just teaching me how to um, keep it down from here and not like keeping it from your um, throat. Okay. Like, not. is that the, what's the key to being a good singer? I've always I've been on the hunt for thirty plus years. Um, the key to being a good singer is to just sing from your heart. Sing Do what you heart. love. Guys, I've been singing from my heart. You remember the Kylie Oki and stuff. We did those series a, a couple years ago. Um, I don't have that gift. AJ is very talented, along also very talented. So again, free classes. And for your teenagers, if you have any interest in making music, in playing music, in singing, this is the camp that you want to go to. We've got the website up, or we've got the info up on our website, azfamily.com. So be sure to head there to learn more about the Phoenix Conservatory of Music. So amazing when young people tap into that passion for something Couldn't so early more. on. Yeah. Uh, it's such a gift. Thanks, Kylie.